Bee Bubble Beep. Hello, beautiful beings, and welcome back to another Space Weather Update with myself, Alexis of Ascension Diaries. It is April 18th, 2021 at around 3.15 p.m. Pacific Standard Time, and oh my gosh, is there so much space weather to tell you. I'm not going to fit it into this three-minute segment, so please come tonight to my live stream to see more if you're interested. But we are currently in a waxing crescent moon in the sign of cancer, but really what I want to show you is the CME that popped off on the 17th right there very huge this is a planet by the way and another one that just 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 happened today on the 18th like literally brand new data and this was that first cme which is coronal mass ejection was following a solar flare which is those magnetic really really strong things that people are really concerned about but it shot in the direction of mars actually which is super interesting to me so those of you paying attention that particular wave that really fast intense one we just saw is going right towards mars and should be landing there around the 24 4th, 23rd, 24th energetically, and we're going to get the backlash of that around the 22nd, 23rd too. This new wave, I'm not actually sure. It's not showing up here, so we'll have to keep looking. The sun is still pretty active, and we did also have a geomagnetic storm on the 17th, which, which means the solar wind was really high that day, and our magnetic field was compressing on itself, which causes the aurora to get really bright. So the last couple days, it's been pretty active here on Earth, if you've been paying attention. Here's a little evidence of that solar Solar flare is hit around a like maybe a C class, but it didn't directly hit us, so we don't even know the full readings, I guess. And yeah, here's the Schumann resonance, which is currently blasting right now in the slow frequencies of 0 to 40 hertz, which our brainwaves do fall within, and the Schumann resonance frequency, which is studied by many of us, uh, it lives within. So the amplitude of the Schumann resonance, the actual frequency it specifically hit in this moment, the height, was an 8.4 instead of 7.83, which is cool. And then it hit an amplitude of 65, which is pretty high. And the Q factor also went up to a 17 during this just most recent blast here at around 3 o'clock in the afternoon. So very interesting. Italy is very quiet still. I just reloaded this, and it's there's nothing really crazy to report in Italy. So I'm just seeing readings over Russia right now. And over here on heartmath.org, they still don't have the data for the last two days. But here's the data over the last week. Nothing crazy or significant. Um, the solar wind is about 100 over average, 100 or 50 over average, which is pretty decent. We're in a, a quiet zone right now in a way, it seems like. But it's going to keep coming. And so basically pay attention this week it's going to be big and i'm seeing also earthquakes over russia and china and we're going to talk all about this stuff tonight like i said please go to my link tree if you need any of these sources i've got them all in here you just got to find them and yeah i will i'm so grateful to be here again another week and i'm wishing you all the very best and good luck with all of these cmes and everything we got this we're we, we're in it together and i will i'll see you next week and we'll review how we did <laughs> Ta-ta till then.